I will say something as an aside, Madam Speaker. You know, last week at the beginning of the week, uh, you know, my heart was in the pit of my stomach when I read that our, the provincial Ford government uh, was um, quietly altering their plan to hit their climate change targets. And I'll say to you that no matter how aggressive the federal government gets with $100 billion and 100 actions, there's no way Canada is going to be able to reach its climate mm -hmm. targets if our largest province does not do its part. As our climate is uh, changing more quickly, quickly than we had uh, thought, these inactions to me are irresponsible, unconscionable, and to me a crime against humanity. Gotcha. Well, thank you, uh, Madam Speaker. It's not entirely surprising that a Liberal member from Ontario would use a speech in the House of Commons to engage in politicking related to the provincial election that's going on in Ontario. But she did actually, she did actually use the term crimes against humanity to refer to a policy of the Ford government. Um, that is quite a serious accusation to be making, and I want to just invite the member, encourage the member, especially in light of actual crimes against humanity that we're seeing in Europe right now, that she would take the opportunity to apologize and withdraw that comment. For Davenport. Uh, thank you so much, Madam uh, Chair, and I want to thank the, uh, the Honourable Member for, uh, for his question because it gives me the uh, opportunity to double down and say that in a world where we have our climate changing so fast and that we know is going to have irreparable uh, imp impacts on our economy, on our lives, on our air, on our water, to me it is unconscionable that there is a province, a territory, a municipality in this, in this country that is not going to do its part to reduce its emissions and it's not going to do its part to decarbonize and to make sure that we, we meet our net zero targets by 2050. It is absolutely unconscionable, it is irresponsible and to me it will be seen as a crime against humanity. Thank you.